Welcome back to Danganronpa Trigger Happy Havoc, where today, and last time, we left off with something beautiful, beautiful occasion. And if you haven't seen it, please go back and watch it, because it's something you don't want to miss. And of course today, we're just going to take a moment to appreciate our no longer having to stand around in this my Zono all day, every day. And now she's gone. Finally. Now we just have a bit of silence. And now I don't have to do her voice again because I honestly did know what voice I had for her. And now let's just jump right back into it. And it's just a breath of fresh air, you know? I mean, she obviously won't take another breath of anything, but, you know. <laughs> When I, when I sat up, I saw someone looking at me. It was God, because he was telling me, You're welcome. And I said, Thank you. Again, it was someone I'd seen before. Oh, hello? Da da da. Ah! Ah, you're awake! Finally, are you okay? Yeah. Now's no time for sleeping. Get your ass up, soldier. Huh? What? <laughs> Um, um, you, you were unconscious, dude. I had to carry you back here on my back. What? Well, well, it's no surprise, considering what happened. Well, what happened? Oh, yeah! Yes! Um... <laughs> hey, are you okay? So, it wasn't a dream? It was a... No, it was a dream come true, Makoto. Yes, sir. What I saw was glorious. It was real. Yes, it was. <laughs> That's right. It really did happen. And I'm showing my teeth to you because I'm serious about it. Sayaka is dead. A deep, dark despair worked as... So, me and Makoto are having completely different emotions here right now. So, for his sake, I'm going I'm to try... I'm going to try to relate to him. But, you know, you know how I feel. Deep, dark despair worked its way through my body and then exploded out of me. I shot up and took off running. Hey, where do you think you're going, Peasant? I have to go see for myself. I have to see if Sayaka's. Sayaka is. Just give up. You can check once, twice, a thousand times. Sayaka is completely and irrevocably dead. No! I have to see for myself! What? Listen to us, man. What what do you think is gonna happen if you go out there? Well, what good is gonna we what, 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 what good is it gonna do if we're just sitting around here? I mean, why are we hanging around the gym at a time like this? Exercising? When we should be exercising our friend's dead body? I don't I don't know why we're going with that. Our friend Sayaka, she's 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 dead! Like that one my chemical romance song! Dead. When I said that, finally hit me. Yes, show it, show it as many times as you would like, game. I realized she was really gone. Gone for me. None of us want to be here right now either. Then, why? <laughs> Shouldn't it be obvious? All I can have her is my feminine voice. <laughs> yes. Monica, he told us all to come here. Ooh, well, hold on. Don't talk like that. We all protested to it. Pros prostituted to it. I mean, you remember that terrible price I had to pay. But... Oh. So... I'm the one who concerns them to come. Right now, we need to do whatever he says. We're his prisoners, right? It's not a good idea to defy him without a reason. Correct. We don't need to make any more sacrifices than we already have. Why should we anything, listen to anything he has to say? It's obvious he's the one who killed Sayak! Go! Wrong! Wrong! Oh, never do that! If you can believe anything, you can believe that! Believe that! <laughs> he's here again, and I'm here apparently. And I'm gritting my teeth like a. Hey! Um. Unless someone violates the school regulation, I absolutely will not interfere. I can promise you. I won't do anything that goes against the purpose of your school ideas. Listen up! I'm famous at Safari Park, so you have the word for following the 
bear one times one. Oh, it's true. I've seen it. But this, who did it? Who killed her? Come on! You already know the answer. The one of you, the one who killed her is one of you. Nobody had a reply for that. Like the one Beatles song called "No Reply," and no one had the reply. Well, well, it's kind of like that, but it's different. But if you know, you know. You know what I mean? Obviously. One of us killed Sayaka. Don't be stupid. That's just... what? Oh, what? Huh? What's the matter? You guys look like you're about to go see a dove get shot up with a Gatling gun. What is this? Duck hunt? <laughs> Don't you dare remember. Don't you remember what I told you when this all began? Yeah! What if you decide to kill Sayaka so that you can graduate? Someone should follow the rules. There's nothing wrong with that. Well, you're lying, right? Of course he's lying. I'm telling you, he killed her. And I have evidence. Like the fact that I think he did it. Wrong. Nope, sorry. What he is a bona, bona fide killer. If they wanted to, the one who did it could just lie to that little fact. What? Stop thinking. I'm looking around at everyone. They all had the same look on their faces. Except him. Or her. Or them. Oh my god. Everyone looked at each other with a combination of fear, suspicion, and aggravate confusion. Uh, uh, That's song on. Uh, are you serious? Are you serious? What, what is this? So, someone's killed someone on my Christian Minecraft it is amazing what some people are capable of. And she's just like, yeah, that's that's fine. Just hold on. Hey, hold on. Don't just assume he's telling the truth. Damn it. Stop talking. That's enough. Before we do anything else, I'd like to confirm something with the stuffed animal here. Hmm. If one of us really did kill her, that person gets to graduate from the school, right? Huh? 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 Come on. Don't play dumb. That's what you said, isn't it? If you kill someone, you get to leave. Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? Oh my god, I just heard a chainsaw or something. Boo! It's Gus! I mean, you're just so naive! You think it's really that easy? You just kill someone and walk on out of here? Hey! You're so naive! Now. Definitely naive! Hellishly naive! No, no, no! The real thing has just begun! The... a real thing? Now then! Uh, are you ready? Allow me to explain the second part of the rule regarding graduation! Just like I explained before, you must kill someone if you want to leave! However... Okay, Jamie Fox. Even if you do that, there's still one more part to the agreement you have to uphold with, remember? Then perhaps... You're referring to rule number six of the school regulations. I say Sam as I'm eating my hand. If you have found a few other black in that commit the murder, you can't be found out by the other students. That is why that is what you're talking about, is it not? In other words... Bingo! It's not just enough to kill someone, you have to actually get away with it! Which naturally means you need a system in place to access whether or not it's been, been gotten away with. Yay! So, a certain amount of time after a murder is taking place, a class trial will begin. <laughs> class trial? Hmm. Yep, it'll begin. Okay, are you, what? Are you a psychic now? No, no, please don't. No, she is a kid. She is goddess for a second. No! Yep, it'll be a few hours after the murder. Now you start rolling on the floor. No! Everyone gathered together, including the black and who committed the murder. Because if they didn't, we know exactly who it is. And then, and they, and the spotless students will all engage in one big debate showdown. During the trial, you'll have to present your arguments about who you think the black and is. I think it's you because you're black. Half black, actually. Oh my god, just like me! God, they didn't come. Yeah, Monica and I are like almost. We're like almost the same. We're both Oreos. It seems like a weird Oreo. And 
once everything comes to an end, the outcome will be decided by popular vote. Popular vote? Only elections work that way. If the answer you've arrived at is correct, uh huh. I'm gonna take a sip because I'm not talking. Only the one that disturbed your peace will be punished. The rest may continue their communal life. Every Why do all the girls look so happy and all the guys are? However, if you choose poorly, we like you poor little children. Then the one who got away with murder will survive. And the rest of you will receive your punishment. Dang, y'all really, really should have watched that show, How to Get Away with Murder. They would have told you exactly how. Which of course means your school life will come to an end. Yes, I get to leave As far as class trial rules go, that's all there is to it. Oh, good. Well, um, so what exactly is this punishment you keep talking about? Hmm. Oh, but to put it simply, what? It's execution! Yeah. The execution! What? And by execution, you mean. Execution is. Execution. Execution! Do I need a dictionary for you? Electric chair! <laughs> Poison gas! <laughs> Torn apart like a paper plane in a hurricane! Yo, he got bars. So, to make sure I understand, if the culprit, the culprit, if, if we get the culprit right, then only they die. But if we get it wrong, then the rest of us get executed. Well, what a smart little chimpanzee you are! Look at you, implying that you didn't do it without actually saying it. You think you were outside the world's called a plagiarism system, a requisition type thing. Which means, you'll be deciding who you think the killer is. Hmm. But chance carefully, because all your lives are on the line. Uh -huh. Okay, let me decide the rule I described to your handbook. Make sure to keep it in mind. A new rule has been added to the regulation thingy. Hey. Oh, I... Ha, I a second. You You're freaking insane. You know that? Huh? huh? <sighs> a class trial? Oh, how is that? I don't want anything to do with that. Why not? Stop it! Why do you mean why not? Because I'm too pretty for trials. Why do I have to waste my time taking out who murdered someone? What? what? Are you saying you're not gonna participate in the trial? Please punish me, wait, just blast me. What? Punishment? Hmm. I might. I don't know if you're in a deep, dark, scary prison or something. Shut the hell up. Shut the hell up. I say whatever you want. I'm not gonna be a part of that. I Oh, don't be so selfish! Stop it! Go on who's being selfish. Kill whoever you want. It's got nothing to do with me. <sighs> the evil standing here right before me, I'm trembling with fear! <laughs> but I won't give you any it to such evil. It's most down to stick out with everyone and resist to the very end. My voice is dying as we speak. If you really want to get out of here, you have to get through me first! Everyone put your hands in the air! As he said that, he's charging at us. Our blow is more of a... But then... Oh dang, she got him! Let's go! Look at this angle! Oh, bruh, they blocked out her under. Are you enjoying yourself now? Oh, great. Oh. Violence against Headmaster Monokuma oh, is not no. allowed! You violated a school regulation! Oh, she don't mess up! To me, godly spear, Gunnier! Oh no. Oh no! 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 Do go! Oh my god. Oh my god. What? So we're gonna leave it on that because we're getting close to 15 minutes and I'm gonna you know, see what happens in the next episode and Shuko's apparently dying so we're gonna we're gonna let her live for a little bit longer but anyways see you next time don't forget to leave a like if you liked and I drink a glass of water bye